Hey there, coffee lovers. In this video, I am going to be taste testing the Starbucks Espresso Roast number 11. It is a dark roast and it is recommended for ristrettos and espressos and not necessarily longos, even though I probably be drinking longos out of this one because it's quite intense. Um, I guess their range goes to number 12, but this is number 11, which is the second most intense thing that Starbucks Nespresso pods offer. Um, well, the pod itself is made of plastic, it feels to me. So unfortunately, they're not recyclable. So they would have to go in the normal bins. Sadly, I hope one day that Starbucks decides to embrace the environmentally friendly pods and uh, make them compostable at least. But if you like the Starbucks taste, this is a really good way of getting that espresso Starbucks taste at home. Um, I can imagine most people will probably make uh, a milky drink with this because of its intensity and darkness. Uh, they probably make something like a latte or a cappuccino or whatever. Um, but I like to drink intense dark black coffee anyway so it's right up my alley the aroma is not quite as nice as some of the stuff i've had especially from companies like sauce because they maintain the characteristic of the coffee but you get that generic starbucks smell in terms of the body of the coffee it's you know moderately dark it's not as dark as i expected but the frothy crema bit there is really, really nice. 